Asteroid 2020, ND is a truly monstrous space rock, measuring in at 170 meters, and it is going to make a close approach to Earth in just a few days. The whopping space rock is almost half the size of Empire State Building, which is 380 meters in height. And NASA and the European Space Agency have revealed the asteroid will make its closest approach to Earth on July 24, when it will come within just 0.034 astronomical units of our planet. One astronomical unit is the distance between the Earth and the Sun, so the asteroid will be 5 million kilometers away from our planet, which is safe. The space rock is also traveling at a staggering speed of 48,000 km per hour. At 0.034 astronomical units, NASA has described the object as a potentially hazardous asteroid. A potentially hazardous asteroid is a near-Earth asteroid with an orbit that can make close approaches to the Earth and large enough to cause significant regional damage in the event of impact. Specifically, all asteroids with a minimum orbit intersection distance of 0.05 astronomical unit or less are considered potentially hazardous asteroids. Due to its relative closeness, it is also a near-Earth object, giving the space agency the perfect opportunity to study it. Before we continue further, be sure to subscribe to our channel, that way you won't miss any of our weekly videos. Near-Earth objects are comets and asteroids that have been nudged by the gravitational attraction of nearby planets into orbits that allow them to enter the Earth's neighborhood. The scientific interest in comets and asteroids are largely due to as they are remainders of material formed in the coldest part of our solar system. Impacts from comets played a major role in the evolution of the Earth, primarily during its early history billions of years ago. Some believe that they brought water and a variety of organic molecules to Earth. The giant outer planets like Jupiter and Neptune are formed from a collection of billions of comets, and the leftover bits and pieces from this formation process are the comets we see today. Likewise, today's asteroids are the bits and pieces left over from the initial collection of the inner planets that include Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. While the chances of a major asteroid hitting Earth are small, NASA believes there is a 1 in 300,000 chance every year that a space rock which could cause regional damage will hit Earth. However, NASA estimates that a vehicle-sized asteroid explodes in our atmosphere about once every year. We don't detect many of these because the explosion occurs extremely high in the atmosphere. However, there are some plans on the go which could help Earth against potential asteroid strikes. Protecting Earth from incoming asteroids will be a huge job. There are thought to be only two ways of deflecting an asteroid. The first is to launch a nuclear bomb into space to blast the asteroid away. The second option is a kind of an asteroid strike, we can use a spacecraft to send a heavy object and then smash it into the asteroid. The asteroid will then hopefully be pushed off its trajectory and miss the Earth. However, for the second option to be any practical use, we would have to know the mass, momentum, trajectory, and surface composition of the asteroid. Otherwise, any attempt at deflecting an asteroid would be less than 99% certain to succeed. And when you're talking a planet killer, that's important. A joint European Space Agency and NASA mission will test such technology in the next few years, you can watch our video on it.